Hey guys. So, um, another blank video. Sorry. Hi. <clears throat> but I'm going to sit you right here because I have some things I want to do. I have to put some, um, I have to wash some dishes. And I got some food cooling off. And, uh, I wanted to talk. I don't know if you'll hear me from here. But I wanted to, I, something came to my mind, um, and I want to ask you guys this question. Serious question for all the carnivores. So, I've heard so many things, oh, don't do lion diet because you're not getting all you're not getting all the nutrients. And then there's people that do lion diet and they're doing amazing. Ferrigno Freedom's one of them. He's a prime example of that. You know what I mean? And because I bought some fish today, it is canned, okay, and I know some kind of oh canned, you're gonna kill yourself with all the heavy metal toxic. <laughs> um <clears throat> First of all, I have heard that fish can help with detoxing heavy metals, depending on the type that you get. I have salmon, which is low in mercury anyways. Um, it's a canned salmon. I don't like salmon particularly, but this stuff's actually really good. It reminds me of a, a it kind of reminds me of tuna, but not like that. But there's just something different. There is something different. I, I tried it today and I loved it. And I actually got a second win with, in terms of energy. I had the worst energy, people. The worst. By the time the afternoon rolled around, I was like, I need to go to bed the moment I'm done with my errands. Because, oh my gosh, I cannot do this. I cannot do this. I cannot go any longer. I need to go home. I want to go to bed. But I didn't want to show that side with the person I was with. And then, I, and I was thinking about adding in some fish because of my vitamin D. And I'm like, well, I want something that I can just pull out. Because I don't want to have to be using up all my resources one day and cooking for three hours, you know, because I meal prep for the week. I still do that with my family member that I'm now doing my work with. Um, yeah, so I have opened that can of salmon. All that's in this salmon is salmon and a bit of a salt, like they, they salt it a little bit. Just a little bit. And it actually does not taste like fake salt. It tastes like the real salt, although it could be just the salmon. I don't know, but it, it doesn't taste like table salt. I can tell now because table salt has very mild flavor, flavoring in comparison. I tried the salmon and I'm like, oh, like I, I feel like a, a good energy, excitable. And it made me wonder, it makes me wonder, like, how are these people on carnivore, the lion carnivore diet, like, how, how, just, just how, how are they doing it? Because, and especially the ones that only eat meat, Bart has to feel terrible. He can't feel good. He can't. Because he drinks coffee and takes supplements. So we know that the, the, all beef, nothing else diet ain't working for him. He's not even doing liver. Liver's toxic. Liver's toxic. I'm sick and tired. Even Anthony Chafee says liver's toxic. I'm sick and tired of hearing it. All right? And for those who continue to tell me liver's toxic, I'm deleting you from my channel. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. If you haven't seen my video from last night, go back and watch it. All right.
So, the I I'm I'm listening to this this like because I'm listening to these like even Anthony Chafee says livers to I can't I can't with these people I can't with these people that say liver is toxic I can't I can't anymore I can't I eat liver like after if I if I go a long time without eating it then eat it again I do have like a detox kind of uh, period where my body's like, I feel like I'm getting sick. And it's really weird. But guess what? That goes away and it and it kind of builds back up. I don't know if it's something with my immunity. The liver's trying to help me flush something out. I've had that every time I go off it and then back on it. So something, the liver is helping me with something. Because if I don't eat the liver regularly enough, then I'm going to get sick. Like I have, I have a horrible, horrible, it's like this, I feel like I'm catching a cold. So I have to at least have beef liver in my diet. I have to. It's, it goes with, a, no, like, I'm not going to listen to you saying that it's toxic. Don't even come at me with that bull crap. Don't even come at me with it. Cause I ain't listening to anyone anymore about friggin' liver being toxic. And the fish. Now, Okay, so some lion dieters do still eat liver. They eat lamb and beef liver. That's good, okay. So, so lion diet doesn't just mean muscle meat and nothing else. We've, just, we've established that. But then beyond that, how are they functioning with the limited amount of iodine they get, the limited amount of, like even a limited amount of, of sun exposure, I would assume for some of them, how are they getting their vitamin D? How are they getting their, like, how are they getting iodine? Are they taking iodine? Not all of them are, I don't think. And some of them do take electrolytes. Some of them do. And it's like, all right. So... I'm not, I'm not against taking electrolytes like, and having salt or whatever, but these people, man, like they're telling us like, like, and then there's, there's the other people on the other side of the spectrum going carnivore. You can't do carnivore unless you do variety. You have to have a variety of meats, chicken, fish, eggs, beef. You can't just eat beef. You can't just eat beef. You can't. Blah, 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 blah. All that bull crap, right? I had to set that down. Move that salt out of the way. You have a lot up in the cover here. What are you doing? Anyway. I learned something new, by the way. I think people have been hesitant to teach me how to use a friggin' can, a can opener, rather. And I've been hesitant because I know that they can be like really finicky. And I've had can openers actually like dent the can when I try to use it. So it never really went well with me, my experience using one. Somebody finally, my, my, my aunt finally taught me how to use it. Best thing ever. Holy crap. It's so easy. I didn't think it was that easy. Because the one that I saw, I don't remember it being that easy. But you do have to make sure it's lined up right. That's the challenging part. But anyway. The, where the salt is, I put the salmon in that, the can in the same cupboard. So that's, that's why I bring that up. But anyway, back to what I was saying. So why are people being, to, why are we being told, oh, don't do the lion diet because you're not getting everything. Um, but then you got people like Ferrigno Freedom, uh, who else, who else, who else, Michaela Peterson, probably Georgia Eid, E-D-E, I believe, yes, Georgia Eid, you've got, maybe even Carnivore Lion, I don't know. But he's been having some weird things. So I don't think he's fully lion diet. If he was, he's not now. 
Um, hmm. Oh, shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. I will put these guys... Let's hope nothing drastic, dramatic even happens when I... I gotta, I gotta move some stuff around in my freezer, guys. Just give me a moment here. You're giving me the heebie-jeebies here. Here. There. Put that, those two down there. so good what's happening is there something to do with oh I don't need as much of this when I'm eating that I don't need so much of that when I'm eating this is that another is that what we're dealing with with lion diet I'm baffled because like these are glass lock dishes, by the way, guys. The covers are plastic, unfortunately. I hate plastic covers. Not my fault. Anyways. These, I don't understand. I just, I wanna know because I don't feel good. Just, I definitely don't feel good with muscle meat and nothing else. Definitely don't feel good with that. It doesn't matter what kind of meat. I, I just never feel good. So, Bart, it doesn't matter. You can't, you can't be telling me to just eat muscle meat and nothing else when I don't feel good. You only tell me to eat primarily beef. Well, I don't feel good. And I'm not taking supplements that have that have frig all to do with anything. Mm -mm. I ain't taking them. I would rather experiment with different carnivore foods. And liver seems to be the best one. Liver took the cake for the longest time. And this fish might help my vitamin D I don't care what you say, it's about what I have researched and um, yeah, and what Dr. Barry says. I'm gonna go with Dr. Barry since I have not expected and every time somebody makes a comment about something, I tried the experiment that they suggest, never works, so I'm back with Dr. Barry every time. I try to keep an open mind and, and listen to other people, but I always end up going back to Dr. Barry because he's not, Excuse me. He's not so in his feelings. You know what I mean? It's not about. It's a it, with him. He says it's all about experimentation too, and I don't think that eating. Um. Whoa. I hate this upper shelf. Oh. That is not good. Oh, this shelf is slanted. No wonder these dishes keep falling down. How can I? How do you get that out? Or can you? I feel like they, sh 
this should be moved a little bit. Readjust it. It's got holes in it. In the, the side of the... Anyways, guys. Anyway. Actually, they're not slanted. I thought they were. These don't stack well up on the shelf. Ugh. Anyways. Story of my life. Um, whenever people like, oh, you should only do this and you should only do that. I don't know. I then, I, that, that's also what makes me go back to Dr. Bear's, uh, philosophies. Because he isn't like, oh, you should only do this way. You should only do that way. You should only be kind of should only eat red meat. Only, only red meat. Only muscle meat. No organ meats because they're toxic. No this, no that, no blah, 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 blah. I'm sick of that. Sick of it. When are we gonna get like, you need to support um, menstruating women. And I'm still a menstruating woman. At my size, you wouldn't believe it, would you? You wouldn't believe it. You wouldn't believe it. You, you definitely wouldn't believe it when you heard my weight. And yes, I've, I've leaked it on my channel before. I've leaked my weight on my channel before. And I've maintained that weight for years. I don't lose, but I don't gain. I'll, I'll probably never gain another ounce of fat on my body. Because my body just don't, don't want it. It don't want it. But I want both. I want some fat and I want muscle. So that's kind of where I'm a little bit down. Because I eat carbs and I don't gain. And then I stop eating carbs because I'm like, what's the point? And then I go down what like two pounds and then I'm like oh, I want carbs because I want to gain it's like a vicious cycle like I can't get it right anyway I don't know I'm not I'm all over the place again but please guys just tell me tell me what is it about lion diet why lion diet Especially these people that tell you not to eat organs. How is Anthony Chafee even, like, functioning? I, I'm sorry, but how can you function with no organ meats in your system? Like, you're, you have this dogma, right? Like, this heavy dogma around organ meats. Don't eat organ meats, it's toxic. I'm so sick of that. So sick of that. Just... You don't make any sense. We eat liver the way people are telling you to eat it now. We shouldn't be eating 50 pounds. Of I didn't say to eat 50 pounds of liver, now did I? I don't even tell people to eat that much. If you can only do four little pieces a day, eat four little pieces a day. That's all it took for me. Four little pieces a day. And I'm like, yeah, baby. Everything's good. You know what I mean? Everything's perfectly fine. We're good. All right, last one. Last one. One, two, three, four, five. Good, got them all. So I didn't, I didn't miss any. Ta-da! Beautiful. So I got ten containers, two on top of, like they're they're stacked in twos. Because if I stack them in threes and they freaking topple over. Because I don't know what's wrong with my freezer, but they're not steady up there. Anyways, now, now I'm done. I'm done. I'm going to sit down. And uh, I need to know. I need to know the answer to this. Let me know in the comments why you think the lion dieters are actually doing so well. And why you think that despite everything, they don't need... Um, they don't need the fish, they don't need the chicken, they don't need the, the uh, eggs even. They don't even need organs, some of them. They don't even need organs. Please help me out here. I know I went on for quite a while, but uh, that's it. 
that's really all I wanted to know in the end here is why why people are doing so well on lion diet. I don't know if I can do it because the only true fat I can find around here is uh, dairy fat like butter. The ghee that I've seen has a bunch of crap in it. And the suet is lamb suet. Is it lamb? Is it suet or tallow? Is it suet for lamb? I don't know. But there was lamb stuff in the store, but I don't like lamb. I don't like the taste that lamb adds. It's not, I just, I don't like that. So I didn't buy it. I don't like lamb. I don't want to do, I don't want to do lion diet. It's, I find that a little bit, because then you start getting into, the only thing is, then you start getting into this, like, I mean, because I, I didn't feel good. I still feel like I'm, I'm missing something with lion diet. I still feel like I'm missing something. Fish is perfect. I like the, I like the fish. And I can't do pork very well. Can't handle that very well. I can't handle dairy overly well either, other than butter. And butter's like the only other fat that I can do. I don't, I, I'm not buying stuff online either. Nope, nope, nope. Not, not for uh, food. Um, I don't think I could do lion diet. I just, my body just, I don't think it could do it. I don't think I would feel the same or different if I did that. Plus, I need some stuff that I'm still not getting clearly from my, just my beef and butter diet. And with maybe some cheese and some eggs here and there. I I can't do it. I have been eating more cheese lately, but... I can't continue like this. I really can't. I can't do it. Anyways, guys, that is it for today. Um, I was going to upload that other one, but I think I'll work on that tomorrow. I've been on my feet all day. I need to just kind of take it easy now. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.